everybody, welcome back to the channel. And today I am going to be doing my unboxing for the month of December. But first, we have a new toy to play with. Uh, I picked up this automatic wine aerator and dispenser. Got a couple of these on my site that I'm going to link below. You'll be able to go find stuff like this, but we're gonna test this out. Uh, just got this. Apparently you put this on top of the wine bottle and you push the button and it dispenses wine. Yeah, let's see how this is gonna work out. So first we need batteries. Go ahead and flip that to unlock. Okay, cover comes off. Batteries get inserted. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we're going to start this with the Nile Eddy. This is our 2019 Pinot Noir uh, that I already know is actually very, very good. Take the foil off. Another one of our toys here is an automatic uh, corkscrew. So we just pop this buddy on here. Make sure you're good and close to the center. And it automatically pulls the cork out for you. When I first saw this, I thought this was an antenna. And I was like, what the hell does this thing need an antenna for? But I realized that this is what actually goes down into the wine bottle. <laughs> so you got a top. This top comes off. And you stick this down in here. We are going to see how this works. Put your glass here. Oh my. And it pulls your wine and it aerates it. Now, the reason that you wanna do this, you wanna force oxygen to interact with your wine. Because uh, if you didn't know that a wine opening up requires oxygen, that's why you have decanters, especially for red wines. So you can do it with some whites, um, but it, I think that you really get the effect of it with like a, your Pinot Noirs, your Cabernet Sauvignons, your Merlots, things like that. Uh, it'll actually taste different the longer you leave it sitting out in contact with oxygen. And this particular device forces that, that aeration process to open the wine uh, a lot more quickly. So, got a little dab here. Let's see. Wow, that's a nifty device. Mm. This wine is so good. Good Lord have mercy. Let's see if I can actually taste a difference. Oh yeah, I can taste a little bit of difference. So when I taste it straight out of the bottle, it's a little sweeter. When I pushed it through the device, it feels, it's, it, it tastes like it's had it's a little more, it's a little less sweeter. <laughs> I'll put it like that. Seeing as how I'm no expert, that is the best way that I can describe. We've got things like this. We've got automatic wine bottle openers. Uh, like I said, the link will be down below in the description. You can go check them out. It's called Cork Spin. They've got all kinds of stuff there. Different colors, different styles. Uh, like I said, this one's battery operated. There's other ones that you actually plug in and recharge, like, a, like your cell phone. All kinds of stuff. Just go check it out. And without any further ado, ugh, let's get into that right now. The last box of the year for 2021. Wine Ambassador, you already know. First up, Celebration Wine. Oh, my. So we... So it was discussed that we actually get a Grand Cru wine, and here we go. It's our 2019 19, yeah, 19 Pinot Noir. Um, if you weren't aware, we have three levels of signing up with us. Uh, 
in, a, in the highest level is what's called Grand Cru. It's like the wine snob. It actually, Grand Cru actually translates into wine snob. This is the biggest package that we have. It comes with the most expensive bottles of wine. And like as a gift for this year, we got one of the Grand Cru packages in the all the other cases. That I cannot wait to dive into the discoveries. Grand Cru. And the Hudson Sparkling. This is the Brute Sparkling. This is going to be our uh, New Year's celebration wine that we do. Love that one. That is another great one. It's just some great, great wines. This Donna Walker Cabernet Sauvignon. Let's move these over here. So the Donna Walker Cabernet Sauvignon, another great one. Last but not least, we have our, oh, this is a Moscato, a 2020, the Discoveries Moscato. I have always wanted to try an actual Moscato, aside from like, you know, when you buy them in the grocery store, your Moscato is always like that bubbly, kind of like soda, like really sweet. This is an actual real Moscato. I've always wanted to try one. Never bought one before because every time I see them in the store, they're a little too expensive. But I got one. Excellent. So this is our wines for the end of the year, our last box for the year. Whew. The Grand Cru bottles, you can easily find each bottle in that, in that box being between $200 and $300 if you were to buy them retail. So this is an incredible present. Uh, present. I was going to say president. Incredible present. Thank you very much. This is Wine Ambassador. You can find more information about that also in the description and as well as the wine opening accessories that we have. So that is it. Thank you very much for joining me. Uh, you guys are great. And don't forget, check out my blog. I'll also have that in the, in the comments below in the description also. And then don't forget, tune in next month for the first unboxing of the new year. We got some incredible things coming up in 2022, uh, and I would like for you all to come along with me on this journey of discoveries. <laughs> so y'all have a great day. Talk to you in the next one. Peace.